Hello, hello. So I'm gonna wait a couple minutes for this to populate, get some people in here, and we'll get started. For those of you catching the replay, thank you so much for watching. Um, for anybody just joining in, this will be saved. So if you'd like to do your treatment with me, you're more than welcome to, if you have some Olaplex number three handy. And if you don't, this video will be saved, so you're more than welcome to join me later and uh, do your own treatment at home. I want to start off by asking how many people have been using Olaplex and for how many years? That's what I want to start. So if you'll drop your name in and drop how long you've been using Olaplex, I'd love to see. Cool, we're getting some people in. Hey, everybody. I hope everybody had a really good day today. We're going to finish it off in a great way with a little uh, core and treatment. Cool, cool. Hi. Okay, let's see. Can't see any comments at the moment. Can somebody comment for me so I can see? There we go. Cassie's been using Olaplex for three years. Awesome. Cool. So my name is Ashley Everett. I am, have been a hairstylist for nine years. I am a salon owner. Uh, I own a salon called Halogen Hair Company in Northeastern Pennsylvania, and I'm an Olaplex advocate. You're getting ready to do training. Yes, the free online training is a great way to spend your time right now, for sure. Olaplex for six months. Great. Wonderful. Welcome to the squad. Cool. So I'm going to do a little corn treatment for you guys today. Um, I'm going to use my Olaplex number three and show you guys what you can be relaying to your clients. And if you're a client watching, this is what your stylist is telling you to do at home. I know there are a lot of questions on this one, so let's clear it up. Let's do a great little treatment and we'll get started. So um, the first thing that you want to do is make sure that your hair is relatively clean. Um, none of that like eight day old hair, bottle of hairspray, gel, like make sure it's reasonable so that the product can actually penetrate through and do what it's supposed to do. Um, so my hair is freshly washed this morning. You're welcome. It was not cute this morning. She had real quarantine hair. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to section my hair out. I'm going to use my spray bottle. Mist it down just a little bit. Um, if you're worried about getting your clothes messy, you can go ahead and throw a towel on. I'm not worried about it. Just uh, an old t-shirt I have that's outrageously comfortable. Besides that, Olaplex isn't going to ruin anything. So I'm just going to mist my hair down. You want to apply this to damp hair, not sopping wet hair. Um, if you apply it to super sopping wet hair, you're really not going to get the full benefit of the product because it has to compete with all the water in your hair. It's going to dilute it a little bit too much. And you don't want to apply it on dry hair because, dear God, are you going to use a lot more product than you need to. With Olaplex, a lot goes, a little goes a long way, so you really don't need a ton. So I'm just going to mist my hair down really nice. Have you guys ever used these continuous spray bottles? They're freaking awesome. I love them. So what's really cool is Olaplex is launching this Friday, the 3rd, the giant number three. I'm so excited to retail this to my clients. Um, I do a lot of fashion color personally and a lot of blondes. So I do a lot of Olaplex color bombs. Um, can everybody hear me okay? Can everybody see everything? Is everything going okay? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna retail the super size number three to my clients and they're gonna get a lot more time uh, out of that product. Especially because I'll do my color bombs where I'll add like a little drop of violet and my blondes will use that instead of a purple shampoo. So I have nothing against purple shampoos, but I do think that they're pretty alkaline most of the time, and I feel like they tend to uh, dry my client's hair out, and they tend to get that kind of drab color deposit if they overdo it, and you know everyone overdoes it. Like, no one's chill with their purple shampoo. So I'll usually, um, I'll usually retail them the regular size of the number three. So the one that's coming out on Friday, the third, is going to be the same size as the shampoo and conditioner. I'm so psyched when they told me I lost my mind over it. So this guy is 8.5 fluid ounces, so this is gonna be the new one. The current one is 3.3 um, fluid ounces. I have to mention this is limited though. Um, so once the plants are gone, they're gone and that's it. But I'm gonna use my number three that I have here. So I'm going to apply a generous amount. I don't do anything a little bit, but apply it through our hands and then you can just go deep. Anna, you can check with Salon Centric on that. You can check on the website um, to check out the price range in your area, country, what have you. So 
I'm just gonna apply this all the way through. If you are super blessed and have a ton of hair, you can go right ahead and section this out. Rob, uh, feel free to DM me and we can talk about that. The MSRP, MSRP? Suggested retail is uh, 56. Okay, so I'm gonna add a little bit more. Make sure I get all the back. Are you guys living for my retro bathroom though? I just moved into this house and it's from the 60s and girl, everything is lavender. So I'm just gonna work this through. What I tell my clients, sure, no problem. What I tell my clients is you're gonna get this all the way through your hair and then you're gonna do whatever else you wanna do. So I usually suggest that they go ahead and throw a face mask on, get dressed and have your coffee, uh, clean the house, if it's a day off, that's what I do. I'll sit for like eight hours with this on my hair and I just like to keep applying it because I feel like, I mean, why not? Um, so I wanna make sure my hair is really thoroughly saturated. I have a couple of clients who will actually go to the gym and while Olaplex doesn't <laughs> recommend like sleeping in anything, I don't love that um, because it could get in your eyes. So I tell my clients who are gonna wear it as a treatment to the gym, just make sure you wear like a headband, like um, some kind of bandana or something just in case you're like hardcore sweating. If you're like a real gym person, make sure you're not dripping down so that the product doesn't get in your eyes. That would be my only concern there. Number three, yeah, so I'm using the Olaplex number three on my hair. So I just misted it down, made it damp. This is it. So when I'm talking to my clients in real time, all I'm saying to them is, hey, so what you're gonna do, and I hold this up, right? So they remember, it's the little bottle. Hey, what you're gonna do with this, and I also feel like a visual somehow makes people remember things better. You are going to use this on clean-ish hair. Day old is fine, whatever. Miss it down, put a generous amount of number three in your hands, work it all through your hair, let it sit for a minimum of 10 minutes. If you have all day long, you wanna leave it on, throw a shower cap on. As long as it's wet, it's working. Do your business, whatever you're about to do, vacuum the house, chase around the kids, whatever you're gonna do, then shampoo and condition. That's awesome to hear, Kim, love that. Um, I've been using it since it became available on the market. I saw a video online, um, I think it was Guy Tang that was like teasing it, and I was like, yeah, okay. If this thing says what it's, it's if it does what it's really saying it's going to do, we might have something here. So I got really enthusiastic about it uh, after I saw that video and I tried it and I thought, oh my God, I gotta be a part of this. So I harassed Olaplex for like three years to be part of the team and I'm so excited that I am. Uh, I've, never, I've never seen a company with such incredible culture. They're just, I mean, phenomenal. Have I tried the oil? Yes, ma'am. So let's talk about those. So what I just did is I just, just rubbed it through. I don't have a boatload of hair, so it doesn't take me long to coat all my hair. And then I can either let it sit because I got short hair, hang out, um, or you can throw a clip in, get it out of your way, as long as it's wet, it's working. So what I would ordinarily recommend to my clients is to throw a shower cap on and then just like do whatever you're gonna do. Um, so what I would do, I also live for the oil girl. Um, Aaron just, I tagged them in everything, all of it. I, I, <laughs> I was a pain in the butt. Hi, I love Olaplex. Hi, my name is Ashley Everett. At every hair show, I just wanted to be a part of it in some way. So I get to come on here and do these cool little lives for you guys. So what you would do at the end of this, your hair has processed 10 minutes minimum. You got eight hours, leave that sucker on for eight hours, throw a shower cap on, wet, working, we got that, okay. You're gonna follow up by shampooing and conditioning. I keep mine upside down because she's a little low. Uh, and conditioning at the end. Um, what you need to remind your clients is that this is not a deep conditioner, it's not. So it's not something that they're traditionally used to with like a lot of really heavy moisturizing agents in it. This is repairing the disulfide bonds in their hair. So it's going to make their hair really great and shiny because it seals the cuticle down really nice. The healthier your hair is, the healthier the cuticle is going to be. It's gonna reflect the light more, it's gonna be shinier, right? Gonna help with the elasticity of your hair uh, and it's gonna help with color longevity. Again, the healthier the hair is from the center, if those bonds aren't breaking as much, 
you're going to be in much better shape. So I tell my clients that Olaplex number three is a do good, not a feel good necessarily. So they still have to follow up with moisture after that. That's why I loved when they came out with the shampoo because I feel like the shampoo and conditioner together really added a lot more moisture to the equation. But my hair, I mean, you guys saw when we started, my hair's baby fine. So I can't use stuff that's really heavy on my hair, but I still need moisture because, uh, hello, she's a level 10, she's practically clear. I need a little love. So I love that they came out with this, doesn't weigh my hair down, gives me phenomenal moisture. Just, my hair's never been in better shape, it really isn't. Uh, and then I like to follow up too with the number six. Um, this is great too because it, again, doesn't weigh your hair down. So I just use a little teeny tiny bit of this guy. I always keep him upside down because he's thick. Two C's. And then I add a drop or two of the oil. I love the oil. I've always been petrified of oil my entire life because my hair is fine. Uh, and this never weighs it down. Gives it crazy shine, super lightweight. And I love that it just like disappears. Like even when I'm using these two together in the salon, I like to cocktail them use them through my client's hair, and like my hands are stupid soft all day. It's unreal. I actually keep number six next to my bed, and I use it as a hand cream before I go to bed at night. It's wonderful. Let me see. So you don't need, we'll go through some questions. You don't need the Olaplex shampoo to use the number three, but I would highly recommend it. Um, it's my favorite shampoo that I've ever used, and I've tried every shampoo. Um, like I said, stylist for nine years. Um, really into trying everything before that even and I just I can't find one that I like better I really do love it lightweight smells phenomenal doesn't linger in a way that is aggressive like some scents do in some shampoos just like really light and fresh um, so you don't need that but I would highly recommend it what do we have here Okay, so the difference from the number two to the number three is it's just the take home for clients. So the concentration of that big long chemical ingredient that repairs the bonds in the hair is just a little bit less than the number three. Um, it's a slightly, um, slightly diluted concentration of it. Um, so that's that bisaminopropyl diglycol demaliate. And yes, it's taken me forever to memorize that. Hello, hello. Okay, so the difference between the number three and the number six. So the number three is the do good. This is the one that has the highest concentration of that active ingredient that uh, is really gonna repair their hair, but it's not gonna give them any kind of coating on the hair shaft. This one isn't highly, highly formulated to increase moisture. It's repairing those disulfide bonds. This is the structure of the house, right? And then these guys are like the paint. They make it look pretty. So. Um, the number six, and again, I always have everything upside down because they're so thick. I love how concentrated they are. The number six is like a smoothing kind of cream. So it's lightweight. I'll show you guys. I literally, I kid you not, when I do my hair, that's it. That's all I need. Yeah, the Moisture Jackie is awesome. I just, I love how lightweight it is. So this guy, super creamy doesn't weigh my hair down. It's unreal how thick it is, but it's, it doesn't make my hair gross. And then I just sit here after I put it in my client's hair at the salon and just mm, rub it in, smell the scent. I love it. I love using it in the salon and people comment on it all the time. It, I mean, it sells itself. It's ridiculous. Hey, Middletown PA. I'm also a PA girl. Hey, hey. Can your client wash their hair every other day with four and five? Absolutely. Yeah, it's an everyday shampoo. So however frequently your client washes their hair, they can use four and five for it, for sure. Thanks so much, Austin. I really appreciate that. I've just been obsessed with it since I started hearing about it and I've made it my mission to just be involved in any way that I can. Um, I love innovators. I love people who shake stuff up, make stuff different. And um, it's amazing to me how much Olaflex has changed what we're doing in our industry they're only five years old. I mean, that's, that's just bonkers to me. So I really like to be involved with it. You have started doing... Yeah, for sure you're an Olaflex candidate, Patricia. Absolutely. If you want to message me, we can talk about that a little further, for sure. If anybody has questions after this, I'll be perusing the comments afterwards and I'll be sure to um, let you know the answers to your questions there. Touch on number three again, sure. So this is going to be the product that your client is going to take home. They're going to use this 
to continue what you're already doing in the salon with number one and number two. So number one, if you remember, is the liquid form. I don't have any hair, but I have boatloads of it in the salon. Number one is the liquid form. So that's that amber liquid, that liquid gold as we like to call it. And you're going to use that in any chemical service, anytime. You can use it as a standalone treatment. I have a lot of gals who do that. I have one who comes in once a week to get a standalone treatment. It's awesome. Number two is what you follow up with. So you're gonna put that right over top of the number one. You're gonna let it sit, do what it's gotta do, continue on with your service. The number three is what you're going to retail your client to take home to continue those results. Love the scent of the number six. Yeah, so it's funny because Elizabeth, what I hear a lot of the times is like super varied thoughts on what Olaplex smells like. So I had the opportunity, I was in Hawaii with them last year, it was magnificent. And I actually got to talk to the chemist and that, that to me is like so neat. Like chemists are like superstars to me. I can't imagine doing their job and what they do all the time to formulate all these products that we need and want on a daily and keep up with the demand of everything that we need as stylists. So I got to talk to Susan, uh, the chemist, and she, I was like, girl, you gotta tell me, what is that scent? She said it is mint, sugar, and oh my God, what was the last one? Mint, sugar, it'll come to me and I'll let you know but it, oh, I love how light it is. You have the number six, great. How often should you use one for three? So it kind of depends on your hair. What's beautiful about Olaplex is you can't like overdo it. So it's not like a protein treatment, like a keratin kind of thing where if you're gonna overdo it, your hair's gonna get brittle and it's not gonna be great. You can use it constantly. Um, what I recommend is clients can get standalone treatments in the salon, however frequently they can afford it. Um, so whatever they can swing, whether it's, you know, they get one once a month or they get one, I have, like I said, a lady who comes in once a week and she just likes to maintain her hair that way. So you can't overdo it. Um, typically for my clients, I recommend they do it every like third time they wash their hair. So whether that's they wash their hair once a week, so they just treat their hair once a month. If it's they wash their hair every other day, I tell them, you know, wash it every third time. It's so hard because everybody washes their hair on such a different schedule. So I usually just suggest every like third time they wash their hair but I do tell them you can't overdo it, so. Let's see what else we got. How do you use number one as a standalone service? Sure, so you're gonna use a half an ounce of Olaplex number one, and you're gonna use three ounces of water. Now that uh, adjustment as far as the water goes, it can be adjusted based on their hair. So like for me, you know, you need that one ounce, you're good to go. For somebody who has hair down to, you know, their lower back, thick, curly, coarse hair, you can add more water to get that product through all the way. Um, but generally, it's a half an ounce of the Olaplex number one and a half an ounce of water. Uh, Olaplex recommends that you charge what you would for your most expensive insulin deep conditioning treatment. So whatever that means for you, your area, your overhead, your expenses, all that. Um, versus in the color service. Great question, Erin. So what I typically do, I charge, um, and again, this is completely dependent on your business, your overhead, all that kind of stuff. Personally, for me, I charge as much as my uh, most expensive deep conditioning treatment. We do a lovely little temple massage and, you know, a hot towel and all the little extras. Um, and I charge that as a separate service. But in a color service, I don't charge as an add-on. I just do, um, I raised my prices 15% across the board about four years ago, and I just include it. I don't like to give people, I don't like them to pick whether or not they can have healthy hair. Like I need Olaplex to do my job, so I'm, I like, I don't want them to have a say. You're getting Olaplex. They don't even think about it. No one's ever questioned me on it ever. Standalone treatment once a week. Um, as Yeah, Amy, so as much as your most expensive deep conditioning treatment is what I would do for that one, whatever that means to you and your business. Uh, you have curly hair. Kim, let's see. To keep it hydrated but not heavy. Ooh, we love Olaplex for curls. So it's nice um, because it's so lightweight. I kind of touched on that earlier a little bit with if you use the Olaplex number three for, um, for your treatment, and then you follow up with the moisture in four and five, upside down as always. And then number six and seven, 
none of these are gonna weigh your hair down. They're gonna leave your curls in really beautiful shape. Um, none of them have any kind of cheap silicone that's going to stick to your hair and create product buildup, which is usually where that weight comes in for people with curly hair. Uh, you know, typically girls are using a lot of really heavy products, gels and things like that, um, mousses, creams, and you tend to get a lot of buildup in there and that's what weighs your hair down. Olaplex will never weigh your hair down. Coming from a girl with super, super fine hair, it'll never weigh it down. The client who gets one once a week. Um, <laughs> so this client is really interesting. Um, she has rough hair. She has hair that's really tricky to deal with. It's, um, her ethnicities are pretty mixed. And because of that, um, she's told me that she's had a hard time dealing with her hair her entire life where she has kind of that coarseness of like a 4C, but it's not at all a 4C. So her hair is kind of fine and long and like, she kind of has a mismatch of curl patterns everywhere and she's highlighted the bejesus out of it before she started coming to us. So between the coarseness, the unruly curl pattern that she has a really hard time managing and the fact that she kind of obliterated it with color, she's had a heck of a hard time with it. So we started doing the Olaplex treatments once a week. We've done that for maybe, hmm, probably about eight months and her hair doesn't break off anymore. It's awesome. She has not let us cut it more than like an inch, but it really, it doesn't break off as much anymore. Like I, I'll, you know, pull through with a comb and I don't see any little bits broken off. So it's really, really cool to watch that happen. Diane, you can absolutely use Olaplex while perming. Um, you, if anybody hasn't downloaded the app yet, Olaplex does have an app, and you can go ahead on there and um, check out all of the directions for all of the services. You can literally use Olaplex in every single service. Recommendation for you, number two usage. Um, I, you run out of number two before number one, girl. Okay. Usually I hear the opposite because people aren't being generous enough with the number two. Um, I kind of just eyeball it based on that client, uh, the density of their hair, the length of their hair, how porous it is because it kind of sucks it up really quick. Um, that one's a tricky one. I would say, hmm, I mean, you guys saw how much I used and I don't have too much hair for the number three. I use about the same for the number two. Elizabeth, we can talk about that more in depth if you'd like. Um, you can send me photos of your clients and I would tell you how much I would think I'd use. Uh, Denise, yes, you can put number one in with your color service. Absolutely, 100%. I use it in every single color service I do. When I do permanent color, when I do demi-permanent color, um, I especially love it for fashion color. If I'm trying to make pastels, I'll go ahead and put number two in my bowl first, and then I'll add my direct dyes to it and mix it up to pastelize them. That's one of my favorite little sneaky tricks with Olaplex. Yeah, Carol, no problem. The app is a really great resource. It's super easy to navigate, really easy to find the information that you need really quickly. Uh, Kim, half an ounce of number one and three ounces of water for the standalone treatment. Yeah, cool. So let me just check if there's anything else I wanted to go over for you guys. Um, I did want to mention, if you guys haven't uh, been using Olaplex yet or you're in need to restock because you're doing product drop-offs, um, what I would do is go right ahead on Salon Centric. They're doing free shipping right now, and that's pretty stinking awesome. So you're gonna save a bunch on shipping, get what you need, um, practice at home, especially if you're not introduced to the line yet. Use it on yourself during this time and really play with it. Get it on your mannequins, do whatever you can at home to prep yourself so that when you come back to the salon, your clients are like, what is this? Tell me all about it. If you're psyched about that new thing, whether it's a new product that you haven't tried before or whether it's some new wonderful education, you can get Olaplex certified for free online right now and always. Um, you can get your Barbicide certification. Pravana, I think, has one. There are so many online certifications. We want to come back like psyched. We want our clients to lose their minds that we were so dedicated to try so many things while we were home. We're ready to roll for them. We are ready. Uh, do I recommend using the smoother and the oil together? Heather, yes! That's my favorite way to use them. I cocktail them together on my hands and I just rub it all through the hair for every single client. Every client I use it on. And they're so ridiculously concentrated that I don't need to use a ton. And it just, it takes me forever to get through the bottles. How am I practicing self-care at home? So I'm doing all the flex treatments regularly on my hair. Um, because we're so busy as stylists, we never get time to do that. So it's really nice to actually take this time and do that. 
you know, putting makeup on and looking fabulous at home, even if it's just for me, no one sees me except my dog, but it makes me feel really good and he gives me little smooches to let me know he likes it. Um, I'm also kind of catching up on some little hobbies that I feel like I've neglected. Uh, I read Elton John's autobiography the other day. It was fabulous. I laughed my butt off. Oh my God, he is so funny. Um, are there any new products coming out? I'm not sure yet, but you'll be updated when there is. If there is, I don't know. Um, how do we get certified online? Um, you can go over to the Olaplex users group. The link is in there. Is there a number eight in the works? I have no idea. I'd be psyched if there was. It's my favorite number, so we'll see. Um, I've also been knitting and crocheting a lot. Um, why don't you guys drop in how you guys are taking care of yourself during this quarantine? Did you like my little corn treatment? It was so simple. It's so simple to do this. I can sit here, I can indulge in my self care, I can have my glass of wine, I can sit and crochet like a little lady I am inside and just treat my hair, treat myself, treat my soul. Oh, I'm so glad, Carol, you're so sweet. I love that. I'm so excited. If you try anything new, update me, let me know. Um, let us know how you guys are taking care of yourselves. If there's anything that we um, can do to help, let us know. Olaflex did roll out that affiliate program in like three seconds after stylists needed a little help. So I know the, the stress level kind of came down a bit and so we're able to take care of our clients in that way too through that. Continuing education, Rosanna, good, yes, absolutely. There's so much great education online. Salon Centric has something for, I feel like every day of the week. Um, so, you know, stay tuned to the page see what's going on on here. There's lots of great education, great content. And like I said, they're doing that free shipping, so take advantage. If you can swing it and you can go ahead and stock up on stuff that you've wanted to try for a while, play around on your mannequin, do what you're gonna do, that's a really great way to keep yourself inspired and excited and to take really good care of yourself and your mental health, have a little structure, a little stability, and then we can get back to work and take really great care of our clients. If you need anything, I'm here, shoot me a message, write a comment, I'll be patrolling through later, answering anything I didn't in the broadcast. And I hope you all try an Olaplex number three corn treatment. I'm gonna follow up with this with the number four and five to wash my hair. I'm gonna do a little deep conditioning after that as well, just for the sake of it. And um, I'm gonna go through with the number six and seven to finish off. Monday through Friday, Salon Centric says they have live education with their brands and it takes the pro team members. Wonderful. I thought it was just about every day of the week. That's fantastic. Um, Tiffany, you can check out the affiliate program on the Olaflex users group. There's more details there. Uh, you can follow me on social media. Yes, oh my God, the most important part. What kind of millennial am I? You can follow me on Instagram at, at beautybyashley, A-S-H-L-E-Y. Super easy, I don't know how I snagged it, but I did. Awesome. Well, thank you guys so much for listening. Thank you for watching. Like I said, if there's anything I can do for you, let me know. And I hope you all take care of yourself. Thank you. Night.